Welcome to another episode of The Traveling Toucan, where we will count down to the top 10 best attractions of London, England. If you are planning to visit Sound London, this video is for you. London is one of the world's most mesmerizing cities. Modern architectural marvels like the Shard Line ancient laneways, peppered with historic monuments, high-end shops, and award-winning theaters. The picturesque streets win their way around renowned attractions like Buckingham Palace, Westminster Abbey, and St. Paul's Cathedral, causing visitors to gape at their beauty and exhaust their phone's photo storage. With so many impressive tourist attractions and captivating things to do, it's no wonder London is one of the most visited cities worldwide, receiving over 20 million tourists each year. In the tenth spot is Tate Britain and Tate Modern. Art lovers cannot visit London without touring its most impressive art museums, the two Tates. Located on opposite sides of the Thames are Tate Britain and Tate Modern. Comprising one of the world's most important art collections, the original gallery opened in 1897 as the basis of a national collection of significant British art, and continued to make acquisitions, needing more space to properly display its collections. Coming in at number 9 is Westminster Abbey. Another location with a long association with British royalty, Westminster Abbey stands on a site that's been associated with Christianity since the early 7th century. Officially known as the Collegiate Church of St. Peter in Westminster, Westminster Abbey was founded by Edward the Confessor in 1065 as his place of interment. In eighth spot is Natural History Museum. Established in 1754, London's spectacular Natural History Museum remains one of the most visited such attractions on the planet. It's easy to spot for its huge Romanesque facade, and a visit is something you'll not want to rush. Arrive early as it can get quite crowded. In seventh spot is Hyde Park. Covering 350 acres, Hyde Park is London's largest open space and has been a destination for sightseers since 1635. One of the park's highlights is the Serpentine, an 18th-century man-made lake popular for boating and swimming. Hyde Park is also where you'll find Speaker's Corner, a traditional forum for free speech and heckling. Moving to number 6, we have St. Paul's Cathedral. The largest and most famous of London's many churches and undoubtedly one of the most spectacular cathedrals in the world, St. Paul's Cathedral sits atop the site of a Roman temple. The previous church structure was destroyed in the Great Fire of 1666, and Sir Christopher Wren designed the rebuild. At number 5 is the Covent Garden Market Halls. The halls and arcades of Covent Garden Market are lined with specialty shops and kiosks selling everything from teas to fine handcrafts to tacky souvenirs. A few restaurants are sprinkled in as well, some offering patios for you to enjoy a tasty treat while people watching. In fourth spot is the London Eye. Built to mark London's Millennium Celebrations in 2000, the London Eye is Europe's largest observation wheel. Its individual glass capsules offer the most spectacular views of the city as you embark on a circular tour rising 443 feet above the Thames. The journey lasts close to 30 minutes, often quicker than the time spent lining up for your turn. If you can, reserve your time in advance. At number 3 is the National Gallery. It's almost impossible to visit London without catching a glimpse of the impressive National Gallery. This iconic, columned museum is set at the edge of Trafalgar Square, home to incredible masterpieces that make it one of the best attractions in London. Ranking among the top art museums in the world, London's National Gallery represents an almost complete survey of European painting from 1260 until 1920. The museum's greatest strengths are in its collections of Dutch masters and Italian schools of the 15th and 16th centuries. Coming in at number 2 is the Big Ben and the Houses of Parliament. Nothing screams London more emphatically than the 318-foot tower housing the giant clock and its resounding bell known as Big Ben. It's as iconic a landmark as Tower Bridge, and the tolling of Big Ben is known throughout the world as the time signal of the BBC. Below it, stretching along the Thames, are the Houses of Parliament, seat of Britain's government for many centuries, and once the site of the Royal Westminster Palace occupied by William the Conqueror. At number one is the British Museum. 
Displaying one of the world's finest collections of antiquities, the British Museum contains more than 13 million artifacts from the ancient world. With priceless objects from Assyria, Babylonia, China, Europe, and elsewhere, it's hard to know where to begin in this expansive attraction. Most tourists head first for the museum's most famous exhibits, the controversial Elgin marbles from the Parthenon, the Rosetta Stone, the colossal bust of Ramesses II, the Egyptian mummies, and the spectacular hoard of 4th-century Roman silver known as the Mildenhall treasure. That's all we have for the top 10 attractions of London. If you are headed to London for a holiday, we wish you a safe and enjoyable journey from the folks here the Traveling Toucan. Do like and subscribe to our YouTube channel for more of your top 10 travel destinations, and check out our other videos which might be of interest to you.